Hi gamers! With hype already beginning for Dawn Trail, I figured it was more than time to discuss some quality of life adjustments that we all want and that we could see announced in the months leading up to its release. These are five small things that would make a huge difference in game. So without any further ado, here they are. Number 5. Raid Trial Currencies Added to the Currency Tab I could go on forever with suggestions on how to reduce bloat in my inventory, retainers, and saddlebags, and one day I just might. But this seems like the easiest, most actionable, most reasonable way to get rid of a few items, especially for some unlucky people who have a surplus. Though I understand that raid gear items may be required to live in the physical space because they need to be rolled on by players at the end of the raid, there really is no excuse for totems. And for people hanging on to several different trials worth at a time, in hopes of eventually either getting the mount or trading them for the mount, it can place a burden on your already tight bags. In either case, in my mind, raid armor and totems are definitely currency, as they serve no other purpose but to be exchanged and should be treated as such. They belong exclusively in the currency tab. Dawn Trail would be the perfect time to slip in this small quality of life change and will make a huge difference. 4. Repair everything at the same time I don't really need to elaborate a great deal on this one. Whether you're repairing from a vendor or repairing your items yourself, there still isn't a repair all button, leaving the only solution to a day of heavy adventuring being to go through tab by tab and ensure all your gear is ready to go for the next day. With the addition of the store all button to retainers, I'm beginning to think that this is as easily said as it is done, and I would be shocked and dismayed if this still doesn't make it in as a quality of life update in 7.0. If you want to control the funds you spend or the matter you use, you can still select items the old-fashioned way, but for those in a hurry, there should at least be the option. 3. Additional search terms for titles, mounts, and minions Ever try to find a particular title? Wanted to show off a specific mount? Or find the perfect minion to go with your current glam? Right now your options are to wade through pages of entries to find what you're looking for and hopefully catch it on the first time through? Or to try to remember what it's called and search for it? But what if you could search mounts based on expansion? Minions based on type? Or titles based on how recently you acquired them? Wouldn't that be a game changer? I don't remember it being such an issue five or six years ago, but in all that time, the number of new mounts, minions, and titles have changed the landscape so much that it is well past time for a new way to wade through them. If we don't see this one in 7.0, I'd really start to wonder why not. Number two, bait in key items tab. Anyone who spends any amount of time fishing has this, the tab of shame. Whether it's on a retainer, in your saddlebags, or taking up a portion of your inventory, it is the lures you need for the fish you catch on the regular, whether in the world or on the ocean fishing boat. So much wasted potential, look at it! As for exhibit B, well, look at this, the key items tab. You can hear the wind passing through the barren landscape. I wouldn't have been as demanding for this change were it not for the introduction of the island sanctuary in Endwalker. Since then, we have learned that they can create an inventory for items that doesn't exist in the physical that you can use for crafting. So why not a similar virtual inventory for gathering? It would be all too easy to create a key item like Tackle Box to store all these lures in and have them available for when you need them. And don't even get me started about materia and dyes. Ugh. Why not the same thing? If we don't see at least one of these items reduced to a virtual menu in 7.0, I'd be gobsmacked. At this point in time, I see zero excuse why it can't be done. Number 1. Pop-up confirm portrait change after gear change Honestly, this could have been anything, but my number one right now is this. Yes! Make a change to your character, add or remove materia, change your gloves, dye your hair, BAM! Pop-up box says, hey, would you like to change your portrait now? And voila, done, that's it. No more DMV photos in your alliance raids, no more wondering why it doesn't seem to be working, and no more deep sighs on the commendation screen as you wonder if anyone would possibly commend your performance with such an unexpiring picture by your name. By now I can only assume that they are well aware of the myriad issues that are plaguing the portrait system, and this would at least be a satisfactory lean in the right direction. I'd wager this change would be something we could see in Dawn Trail. But what do you think? 
Would these have been your top five? If you have another good idea for a likely upcoming quality of life update, please let me know in the comments below. I'd love my comment section to be bursting with fantastic ideas. Thank you so much to my patrons and to the givers of bubble tea over at Coffee and gamers. I will see you in game.